fellow book questers. So I, book quester, I'm just here to thank you guys all for what 1K subs. I mean, well, I'm a little bit late to the party. I already have like 1.4K subs. That's like 1,040. That's great. And my channel's been growing like a lot. And I guess that's kind of thanks to the COVID-19 pandemic because people just watch a lot of YouTube and I do have a little bit more free time on my hands to create more content. So yeah, and read a lot of books. And I just have to thank you guys a lot. And I've never dreamed of 1K. I mean, I was like, yeet when I hit 100, maybe a year ago. And in two years, I've managed to get 1K subs. And in my opinion, that is pretty fast. And I appreciate every single one of you subscribed to me. And yeah, I mean, I'll do, I'll keep doing what I do best, reading books. And I hope you have a good day. So in celebration for 1K, I decided to show you guys some um, background footage. So this is when I'm recording the Golden Compass, the first book of the Dark Materials. Usually my dad um, films for me because it's just so much easier and he is a really good filmer. And yeah, I just try to be energetic and try to live up to the role. And that's what I do. And of course starts the process of editing. I first looked through my camera roll get what I need, and in this case I'm making a time lapse. I usually use two different editing softwares, two or three to be honest, when I'm making a video. DaVinci, iMovie, and you know, um, PowerDirector. Now I usually just use iMovie, mostly because it's so fast and it's just simple, but if I really need to do some complicated editing then I would move on to either PowerDirector or DaVinci. I would prefer Power Director because it is, after all, a little bit more easier than DaVinci. And of course, there are times when I actually don't edit at all. And I usually use my iPad, I sometimes use my MacBook, but I usually use my iPad because I'm too lazy, okay? Then, after keeping the video in the, in the drive of my Samsung computer, I mean the home Samsung computer, whatever, I then make the thumbnail. Now, usually I don't make it, usually my dad makes it, but, you know, sometimes I just kick in and make it, and my dad helps with a lot of this stuff, so big credits to him, I couldn't have been a good YouTuber without him. Let me reveal something. So, I am Book Quester, but I am also Firestorm, Firestorm Plays, a Minecraft YouTuber. And I would really appreciate it if you guys could go and subscribe to that channel too. Because, well, well, I read a lot of books in my free time, but as I am a normal person, I do do video games. And if you do like books, and you also like Minecraft like me, you definitely should check out my other channel, Firestorm Plays, where I do post Minecraft content weekly. And uh, turn on my notification bell, um, watch it through and whatever, and leave a like, comment on your opinions or what you think of the video so I can get some good critical feedback. Thank you, and that was a really shameless plug. So, um, yeah, I just want to thank you all again, and I just literally know it says that I hit 1.05k, so that is just crazy to me. And I love every single one of you who subscribed to me, and I appreciate every single one of you people. And yeah, thank you so much for subscribing. I mean, let's be totally honest here, without you guys, I would never have been able to um, evolve from, wait a sec, from that, yep, better not to play that, to that. Although, I am better at commentating now, and yeah, thank you guys so much, and yeah. And like always, your book quester, Aaron the book quester, just wanted to thank you again and again how much I appreciate this and how much I am thrilled about this. So thank you for helping my channel grow and have a great day and read some books in quarantine. If you're even more bored after reading a fantasy book, then visit my Minecraft channel. Goodbye.